Um, going forward, we are also advising that uh, they, became, they become more keen in construction because we established that uh, the collapse was not actually because of majorly on the rains alone, but because of work, poor workmanship, especially on very old toilets, which had very poor foundations, poor uh, construction in one of the toilets that we saw that collapsed in Kakwegori, Kakwegori Primary School. That is a newly constructed toilet. I think it was hardly two years old and it has gone down. Uh, that one you could see the workmanship was not good. So we have also, uh, we are going to have our, the meetings with our head teachers and uh, our officers so that we also emphasize on the need to supervise construction, especially on critical installations like those toilets uh, in a way that will be able to withstand the pressure of, uh, we, uh, uh, for example, wind and even the raging waters if we have excess waters. For most of the schools where the toilets collapsed, we have also advised the schools to fence off uh, the areas so that we do not have a situation where uh, students are going very close to the to the sites where the toilets collapse because we still have some gapping holes in some we have told them to seal off i mean to to fill up the the toilets because you know some of them are quite deep